There is a eureka moment uh, that happened uh, early on in, in the work that Novick and I were doing. Uh, he isolated the first mutant and he could see using simple assays that the enzymes that normally are secreted outside of a yeast cell in this mutant now build up inside the cell. But the most dramatic moment came when he looked using the electron microscope at sections of this cell and uh, he called excitedly up to my office from down in the basement where the electron microscope was and I went down and I had a look and it was you know revelation to see a cell that ordinarily has only a sort of sparse collection of organelles, uh, but which instead in this mutant had, was just dying of overload of the vesicles that were being produced but couldn't be delivered to the cell surface. And so the cell has, it just accumulates with lots of vesicles. And that was, uh, you know, th that one image stands in my mind as, the, as really the beginning of my career. And I knew from that moment that, that I would be consumed for the, at least the next 20 years trying to figure it all out. And, so that was really a lucky break.